everyone hope you're all okay right i'm on one again <laughs> with my beloved cosmic shimmers by creative expressions all the polishes that i've got um a lady called Kristin najar I i'm sorry if i pronounce your name wrong Kristin, um but she asked me if I'd used them or did they work over other mediums so I thought right I'll have a go <laughs> who who am I not to do eh <laughs> I mean I mean I know it's a bit of a chore and everything <laughs> not so and it's making me get loads of stuff out that <sighs> right look at these I have had these forever. These are glued baby wipes, etc., inspired by Jenny Belly, and I must have done these five years ago. <laughs> I don't. I've probably used some in something, and she, what Jenny Belly did was just basically glued um, baby wipes together. Some of these are not. That's baby wipe. Um, and I've got these are, they could be dryer sheets, they're probably dryer sheets or something that I'd use to mop paint up or and some of them I've sprayed paint. Oh God, I've got so much stuff, it's ridiculous. Anyway, so that was what I tried on first, on a, a, a piece first. And these, this would have been like spray inks. So uh, um, I used my lovely Harlequin stencil. I love this, I love that stencil. And this one was with the uh, Lavender Blue, the Opal Pearl. Lavender Blue, I hope my camera's all right. It looks a bit school whiff. Uh, and it's just beautiful. <laughs> so that was that one. And I was just getting a bit carried away and I thought, right, I need to put my camera on and come and do a, um, show you a few pieces. Uh, this one, this card is, I've got a pile of these as well. <laughs> oh, God. oh, dear, dear, dear. Uh, this was when I did the um, isopropyl alcohol on acrylic paint and i'll leave the link to that video if you've not seen it now i love doing that absolutely love doing that uh, it was a technique that i first saw laurie marie jenkins do and i loved it i just just love doing that look that's just so beautiful some of these have been sealed um so that was that was the lavender blue and it's just but i love the texture because it i put it on quite thick i just love the texture that it gives but because this was the same sort of colors it's not picking it up so much but it still give it a little bit of something so that was those two then the next one i did this was again this was the alcohol on not written on the back of a lot of them but it looks as though it's the alcohol ink on over uh, not alcohol ink the alcohol isopropyl over acrylic paint and this was on there on photo cards the, this one is and i used the same stencil but this one whoops was the luster polish in plumtastic It works over there and that the, yeah it's just lovely what else did i do have i done that one no i've not done that one i've done something else oh this one this one's a bit psychedelic <laughs> it's the is it andy skinner stencil that one and again this was on book page two pieces of book page glued together and they're acrylic paint with isopropyl over the top i just put that on it and uh, it's that is really textured because it's gone underneath but it's lovely look you can feel it look it's lovely so that's that one 
And then I thought, right, well, I'll try. So I've got some of these pieces of like chipboard that my lovely friend Dee from Black Cat Crafts sent me ages ago. So for this one, I've just used it straight out of the pot and I thought I would do the opposite. Where's my paints gone? I've used the, uh, the metallic gilding polishes. These are like a deeper concentrated, well, they're all concentrated, but a deeper, what's the word? Whatever the word is, um, paint. And I, I just went over it with the red, the rich red to start with, and then I used this stencil. And because it's quite fine, you know, I've probably put too much on, but I, I really like it. I think that's lovely. And that only had one coat. So I'm going to do it on the back just to show you. So I'm going to use this Ocean Teal Gilding Polish. And they're all the by Cosmic Shimmer. And I hope this goes on because the red just went on straight away. Oh, just, just covers it up straight away. No primer, no... <laughs> Nothing, it's just wow. <laughs> and I've hardly put any on there. You can just see the cardboard. Let's put a little bit more on. Oh, look at that! Wow. I'll just leave that for a minute to dry, it doesn't take a minute and then I'll come back to that in a few minutes and put the red over the top of it. Um, I don't know, hmm. I, don't, well, I, don't, I, I don't think the others will cover that up, I think it needs to be a, a gilding polish to cover it. So I'm not going to do that one. What else shall we use? What else have I got? Oh, I'm going to use another one of these. Right, we use th this is the acrylic with the alcohol. As you can see, some of them turned out better than others, but nothing gets wasted. So what colour shall I use over the top of that? Oh, let me use this stencil. Uh, no, I won't. I'm going to use this one because I like it. So, shall I just use a bit of... Oh, decisions, decisions. There's too much choice. Shall I use the green? No. What about gold? Shall I use golden glow? Use a bit of golden glow. See what that looks like. Oh dear, pot's going down, look. Oh, I'm having a good day today. I like doing these painted videos, really don't know why I've not done any before. I suppose because I just think people won't want to watch me which is a bit stupid because I know I like watching people do them uh, I don't mind if it goes under the stencil don't mind it because like I say it just gives it that bit of texture don't think it's going to show up very well is it this colour but you'll be able to no oh, it is able to see it a bit where well, I've put it on thick see I like that I don't want it to look smooth I don't think well I know I don't <laughs> Again, it's just like adding um, texture paste so pretty so that's that one 
else can we do? What else? What else? Uh, I'm I've picked the the good quality stencils. I'm not sure how good these sponges will go through my finer stencils. So I just thought for this I would use the, some of the better quality stencils. What else have I got? Let's have a look. Pulled out loads of different. Right, I've got loads of book pages here. Look, that I've done with this would be just acrylic paint. Okay, it looks quite flat, flat, flat. So let's make it sparkle, shall we? Get under there, you little monkey. Where's my plum one? Here we go, plumtastic. We'll have a bit of purple sparkle. This is the luster, luster polish. Look at that, gorgeous. It's like jelly, this one is. Ooh. Oh, I so like it a lot. We had an absolute downpour earlier on and I felt so sorry for the driver delivery man across the road with there having building work done across the road and he got all these great big lorries with the the crane thing on and it was absolutely pouring down um we only live in a tiny little narrow lane and there was a van coming down the street and he couldn't get past and oh dear I did feel sorry for this delivery man you see the sparkle now that's really cheered that piece of paper up it's lovely hmm. right what I might do before I forget let's move that out of the way let's do this one with this look at that that's just so gorgeous ocean teal Well, I know traditionally if you was going to make a tag you wouldn't do pattern on the back but I'm not a traditionalist. <laughs> Just a playist. I like to play. So what am I using? Rich red in the metallic gilding polish. So it might all be clumped together because there's any fine little pieces. It's a delicate little stencil. I like this stencil though, it's it called lattice work. It's one of my first stencils that I've got. Oh look at that! Oh I do say Oh, I think I like that side better. Or do I? Oh, no, I like them both. <laughs> so, well, quick and easy. Lovely jubbly. So that's that one. That's cleaned that. I don't wash my stencils. I used to do. Uh, I tend not to do, although I think I probably have done that one a little bit at some point. What else was I going to do? Uh, right, let's have a look at this pink one. Uh, 
Ooh, 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 ooh. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. That was a pinky one. Lilac pearl. Lilac pearl. Lilac pearl. Hmm. Right, what about if I go over this one? If I go over all of it with this, we'll just try a little bit to start with. So watch this. This is an opal one. See what that does. Oh! Oh, wow. You see? I wasn't expecting that to show up as much as that that's really because i mean it's it's nice but it's just flat <laughs> and this is what i like about painty stuff if you do something i mean i never ever throw anything away no and it breaks my heart when people say oh i did this and i just didn't like it i threw it in the bin i was like no throw it my way you can always do something with it even if you you know put it in a a naughty drawer in a naughty cupboard a naughty folder put it in quarantine for a while then go back to it later on and you find something else to do with it right well I, I was going to do something else with that but i think i might just leave that because that's really cheered that up i don't know whether you can see what did i say this one was called lilac pearl so yeah it's sort of pearly lilac that's really livened that up i was going to do a stencil and in a pink but I don't think I will I'm just going to leave that one that's that one what else can we do next right what we got over here oh my god I've literally got everything out there's stuff on the floor because on my shelves um, I'll, I'll show you one day but on my shelves I've got all Oh, here we go. Let's have a look. All folders, similar to this, just with book pages, deli, and folders and folders and folders of them. And this one just says photo card play. So let's have a look what's in here. Oh, you've seen these before. We do that one. Yeah, a lot of these are probably their cosmic. Uh, is it cosmic shimmer? But um, from draw. Oh yeah, cosmic shimmer pixie powders. There's me thinking I didn't have any cosmic shimmer paints. It could be those uh, products. I mean, or it could be these Kenner Oliver bursts Have a look at these. right what have we got here opal polish blue wisteria I'll have a go at this that lovely jubbly lovely jubbly what's today today is tuesday but i probably think it is anyway yeah tuesday the 18th of something august that's the one august uh probably won't get this up until tomorrow So, yeah, this is on glossy photocard. I can't remember how I did it. Did I spray? Did I probably sprayed it with water and then put the powder on or put the powder on and sprayed it with water? I can't remember. I've had them that long. 
if anybody can remember <laughs> just write it in the comments box <laughs> See whether this will work. Just a tad, just a, just giving it a little bit of subtle glow to it. just so pretty oh, lovely right now what so that was blue wisteria so now we've got a green one I mean, look, look how dry, dry oh, there we go look how dry they quick <laughs> look how dry they quick if I start talking backwards all the time, you'll soon get to know what I'm talking about, won't you? Look how quick they dry. That's what I mean. Do this one. A bit of orange. Should we have orange? Luster polish. We'll have a bit of orange on this one. It's got the sparkling lot. Sparkly, sparkly. Still some in the lid. Tango, tango teas. Something like that. What other stencils can I use? What about? Oh dear, who knows what they're about. I've got some punchinella in here. So, yeah. Let's do a bit of punchinella. Ah, oh, that's very pretty. So yes, Kristen, you can use them over other things and on other things. Just going to leave that like that. That's really sparkly. See, these ones don't have the two tone. It's only the the opals that have the. Do they call it? Do they call it interference? No, it's not a right word, is it? Interfere. I think it is actually. Is it interference when it's the two tone? Beautiful. I don't want to stop now. What else can we do? What else? What else? What other things have we got? Flat. A flat. No, that's shiny. Something flat. I want something flat. That's flat. Oh, they're all shiny. These must all be on the glossy card then. Oh, that's a flat one. And that's Harley Quinn. So, where's my little? Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to find it. Just check amongst yourselves a moment, please. So, what have we got here? Yeah, there it is. Right, if I... I can't see. Just a minute, I need to get this under my nose. That's like that. So if I just put that off a little bit, shall we do the sparkle, the green sparkle? Let's 
the luster apple fizz is it oh got that one right apple fizz tango teas that other one the orange one oh i can't, really can't see right it's gonna be hit or, hit or miss Oh, yes. All shiny, glittery. Well, not glitter, but shimmery. Very lovely. Oh, still missed a bit. She missed a bit. There, that's better. She's made a pretty one of that now. What else? What else? Are you fed up yet? How many minutes are we on? 26. Oh, dear. What else have we got here? We've got everything. Mental. Let's have another piece of. It uh, looks like that's been sealed with something. But I'm not quite sure what I'd sealed it with, whether it's Mod Podge or what. But it's very shiny. I don't think it's just it's a. Uh... Oh, that actually says matte on there. So that would have been a matte photo card with acrylic paint of some description and flicked on with isopropyl and then I decided to go over it with a well, it's probably not Mod Podge some sort of sealer anyway because I, I only buy the matte one and that's quite shiny so what do we want on this one should we go oh, no maybe not that one Blue pearl. Shall we try blue pearl just to give it a little bit of a shimmery, wimmery? Hmm. Excuse me a minute. I don't know whether I dare risk one of these other stencils. No, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to get this one out. Old favourite, because I do like it. So I'm going to do blue. Now, it's that one, golden glow, golden glow. We'll do golden glow. Well, I might do another colour over the top as well. Because we can, can't we? What are you all up to today? Anything exciting? Are you crafting? Yes is the right answer. <laughs> Just don't leave me to craft on my own. It's not good when I'm left unsupervised. Yeah, so because this is sealed, shiny, it's not... It is picking it up where I'm putting quite a lot on and it's going under the edges. Now, because I'm not bothered about what happens with these, my stencil doesn't slip. If I was doing a project for a challenge or for somebody's birthday or something that it needed to be good... My stencil would slip, wouldn't it? It's a bit thick there, so we'll just dob it like that. We'll just dob that bit, dob that bit. 
Doesn't that look pretty? I can't believe how much of that one I've used. Good lord. So that was Opal Pearl, Opal Polish, sorry, Golden Glow. On the like a, a teal blue. Well, I think, I don't know. I don't know what paint I'd used. Trouble is, you can't, when you're doing things, you can't, oh yeah, I've done that, I'll write on the back. Oh yeah, I've done that, I'll write on the back. And then you forget, don't you? Well, I do anyway. <sighs> right. <laughs> we do another just another bright and a piece of flat looking paper I don't know how I've done that whether have I got a stamp or a stencil hmm. oh yes I do yes I remember now yeah What do I want? Sorry, I was just... Colour shall we have blushed? Shall we have blushed peach? It's a peachy colour. See what this one does. It'll only be pale. I think. Should I try at the bottom? Yeah, that's alright. It just gives it a shimmer. Brightens it up, makes it for feel more alive. I'm just a flat piece of boring acrylic paint. No, I'm not. I'm nice and bright and zingy now. Yay! Oh, isn't that just lovely? It's just like I remember old oh, years ago I went to. Isn't it funny how things spark your memory off? Went to London with Mr Doodle and my stepdad. It was, I think it was not long after my mum had died. Anyway, we went to London. Whether it was on a bus trip, I can't really remember. And we stopped. We were down near, somewhere near the London Dungeons. We didn't go in there, but we was down that area and there was an ice cream van. And my stepdad bought us these ice creams and they were, we, he just went and said, three ice creams, please. Because <laughs> it's very expensive in London. And <laughs> I think he needed a bank loan after that. It was really expensive. But what I was going to say was, it was this colour and it was the most delicious ice cream. I can't really remember what flavour it was. But it was just, uh, oh, it was lovely little useless piece of information for you there yes so that's made that little piece of paper come alive do we do that side do that side with a different color Have you got the impression, people, by now that I quite like these products? I know I haven't mentioned it at all or anything, but... <laughs> uh, what one shall we use? Oh, God. Indian pink. No, that's a gilding polish. I know, we use this one, Golden Flamingo. We'll just go over it again. So this is the one of the opals again. Oops, far too much on. Oh, that's covering that up a little bit too much. Oh well, we'll go with it now. We'll go with it now. We'll cover it up. If I could just take it off with a baby wipe. Shall we try? Well, it's made it shimmery, if nothing else. Right, so let me get a baby wipe. 
see if it'll come off with that. Oh yes, there we go, look. But it's still shimmery. So, that's lovely. What's that golden flamingo opal? I'm going to have to go in a minute in 35 minutes. Huh. I might just continue doing these. What are the colours? What are the colours? What are the colours? What's that one? Blue parakeet. I haven't got a favourite. Steph asked me. Um... She said, have I got a favourite? No, I haven't got a favourite. I've heard a couple of people say that the blue parakeet is the favourite. And I get that, especially on the black card, because it's beautiful. But then, to me, they're all beautiful. I just... And I don't have a favourite between the the opal polishes, the lustres, or the the gilding polishes, because they've all they're all just so yummy. In my opinion. Yeah, that's really pretty on there. See it glistening. You can see the blue and the green in that. Well, I, I can. I don't know whether it's picking it up. Oh, I just love it. Right, I think I better go now. Days. itching to do more what else have we got oh there's a big sheet there look right let's put something on this one I want I want I want where is it so we'll have a bit of I mean that's lovely like that and I'm only playing so it doesn't matter um no, not that one. Has it gone? Who's got it? That one and pink. I'm going to just use so I'm going to use the pink gilding polish Indian pink gilding polish which you won't be able to see through this one You can actually because it's a dark background. I thought that would actually show up more on there. That's a pink. Ah! We've thumb trapped in there then. A danger to myself. And I want to use some of the luster in the plum tastic. Oh. can't 
see that a lot but that's fine now i was going to use the blue luster but i think i might use this ocean teal so it's sort of that color see what that looks like oh yes hello Thank you very much. I like that. Can you see? Look at those colours. She's just about to pack up and then it gets good. <laughs> what else have we got? I don't, did I do a... I don't think I did one on the... Did I? I can't remember on the baby wipes. Alright, let's do the baby wipe. We do a baby wipe. We use Old Faithful. Which colour shall we use? Should we use the. What did I use on that other one? I used lavender. Don't know, I'm going to use a bit of. Fantastic sparkle. Oh, I say. So plumtastic. That's lavender blue. This is the opal. Oh, just look at that blue. Oh, that is just heaven. That is, oh, I love it. Oh, that's just so pretty. Look at it. You can see the blue and the lavender. Still not, I'm not saying it's my favourite though. This is quite porous, this one. It's a, a, a baby. Oh, look, though. Because it's baby wipe. But it has got glue on it, so... Put a bit more on. Yeah. I will ever get around to doing with these pieces I do not know Look. what else should we do should we do some little put that back there hmm Use a bit of pink. The pink one, Indian pink. Shall we try? Shall we? Shall we try? Where's my punch and elegon? Oh. Oh, there it is. Am I going to show up? Oh, yes. Yeah, if you've not seen Jenny Belly's videos, well, I presume she's still got them up. She's, I've not seen any of her videos for a, for a long time because she, I think she went off of YouTube for a while, but she was one of the first persons I ever watched. And she does all sorts of things. She's ever so good. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Right, my lovely people, I'm going to go, <laughs> otherwise I will never be able to get this video uploaded. But I will I'll just show you the bits we've done again, that's the 
last one we've done so this is I'm not quite sure what it is it's got little can you see it's got like it's like perforated but there's two sheets of it probably a dryer sheet or something but glued together they were a bit fiddly to do if I remember rightly there's that one all shimmery whoopsie this one that was the baby wipe the dryer sheet or the wash sheet I have those wash sheets that you put in color catchers that catch the color especially when you like buying new stuff and that and then I just saved them and I probably just mopped up with it or something or I don't know that one I love that one it's dark on the back oh we should have done something on that we're going to do Oh yes, can't leave that and we're going to have gold on this. Or shall we have, no, we'll have blue parakeet. Come on, where are you? Blue parakeet, that one. Yeah, it's orange in the, no, it's orange, look. It's that deep orange, you know that orange, don't you? <laughs> it's green in the top. When you put it on black, well, hopefully it's. I don't know whether this was black card or. Hmm, looks as though it's got red and blue underneath. Anyway, I'm just going to go all over it with this. Look at that. Wow. Going to go all over it because I can. Because I can. I just think they're amazing how they change colour. How can it be green in the pot? I mean orange in the pot. <laughs> I'm getting used to all these new colours. Names for these colours. Yeah, how can it be green in the pot? And then you put it on there. And it's blue. But you can still see green as well. Look at that. Fantastic. Can you see the difference? 47 minutes. Right, I've got to go. I love you all loads. Thank you ever so much for watching. As per usual, 10 gold stars if you get to the end. <laughs> oh, look. Blue, green, blue, green. Just like that, it's dry. Surfaces like this, it's... Uh, um, they dry quick, but the, the paper, it didn't dry quite so quick, but they're still dry, they're still all dry, which is great because you can just sling on your desk like that, whereas when you're using normal paint, you can't do that because they don't stick together. But that dry a little bit on my hands, but nothing really. Great for anybody that doesn't like mess, I think. Right, thanks very much for watching. Take care and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.